Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are back in Icarus for episode three. In the previous episode, managed to eventually um, get enough fur to actually build our bed. That was uh, more trouble than it was worth, but hey, no, my not much trouble than it's worth, but it was more trouble than it should have been. Oh, there's a wolf. I'm going to get the wolf. Because we don't want wolves prowling around. Where is he? There he is. You just sit there, Mr. Wolf. And I will, uh, get my knife out. There we go. Oh. Alright, skin him quickly. Oh, my knife broke. And I'm nearly out of oxygen. Okay, just drop that in there. I'll take care of the oxygen. And then skin him. Next target is to get to level 5, which is why I want to kill the wolf anyway, to get experience points, and also to craft a oxidizer. Uh, this little chap here, and I can do that now. Let's craft that. He will go just here, and actually just here. Put him here. Where's he gone? Oh, there it is. Let's see if it's looking. Um, so, stick him by the door. Just so I can grab them on the way in, the way out. And as long as I've got oxide, uh, oxide in my inventory, which I do, I'm just going to pull that back out of there for now. And stick it in there. Now that I've done that, I'll just stick that into there. Uh, raw meat. Destroy that. No, spot meat, sorry. Um, and you see this little bag slowly fills up, and if I click on it, it fills my oxygen up. Um, my water's not oh, too low, but it's got a quick drink. I managed to get away without being poisoned or infected with parasites. Uh, my food's okay. I can hear all those bleeding horses again. Uh, let's just stick the meat on there to cook. And have a little bit of sword out. So. What have we got? Berries down the bottom. Food down the bottom. And arrows down the bottom. Um, oh god, I've only got two arrows left. What I want to do is... Um, I'm just sorry, come on, I'm sorting this out. I'm sorting this out. Uh, I don't need all the sticks. I have to get rid of the other ones. Keep the lesser pile on me. Same with fibre. I can go under there. Don't need the fur anymore. Keep some wood on me. Keep some bones on me. Let's get a hundred stack. Get rid of that. There. Um, I've got a spare torch on me, I'll hold on to that. The sticks can go in there, leather. Um, that can go in there, don't need that for the minute, just stick the food down there. Um, you can build a backpack with an extra row uh, later on, but for now I just want to tidy that up a little bit. There we go. Yeah, so I was saying I want to get up level 5, so once I'm level 5, we can start building bone weapons. So what I'm after is a bone arrows, bone knife, bone spear. And I also like the fire pit, because then the fire pit I can build in here. I don't have to worry about the rain putting the fire out or being out there, and there's more storage space in it. Let's fill up now. Let's just make sure we've got enough. Oxide in it to keep it going. There we go. Shall I drop the stone? I'll keep the stone on me a moment and I'll make sure. Oh, definitely. Okay, I'll drop the stone for that. Right. So, it is a case of harvesting, hunting, to get myself up a little extra bit to get the next level, level 5. And that's all my food just run out. Okay. So let's have some of that, some of that, and some of that. Okay, and now let's do the collection. I 
I'm also be looking at expanding my base a little bit. I don't want to do too much at this point because wooden base, uh, wooden walls get damaged by the wind and things and the weather. Uh, once I get stone, I can uh, replace the walls and the floor with stone. I'll leave the this floor as wood and I'll put a second story on with a proper roof. Um, it'll all be stone. But that's why I put a flat roof in here to begin with because the intention is that I'm going to go up there. I'm going to expand this out sideways both that way to the back and to the side. I always make it 4x4 four four, instead of 3x3 three three. and then put a, a second floor to roof on. So I'm just going to grab some more oxide on it and see it. So it's going to suffocate. So much easier when this just goes straight in the inventory and you have to stop and pick it up and cut the tree down so quickly, especially normally because we've got a steel axe by there, or at least an iron axe, which cuts it down so much quicker anyway. There we go. A lesser bit. There we go. Let's put the sticks up on here. Uh, pick that up. Pick that up. And you know what? It's got a couple of carrots. As soon as they're here, we'll roast them. Take that wheat and stick it all in there for now. It's condensing packing. Let's chop down another tree. Yeah, the physics sometimes me means that the logs fall through the floor, or the cut sticks fall through the floor, or they spin off into the distance. But I don't think I've ever been hurt by one of the sticks spinning off into the distance. But uh, yeah, falling through the floor is annoying. It's obviously it's lost then. It, uh, it's out of the game. Out the game world. Okay, how close are we? Oops. Um, 47, only 48, 630. Uh, how are we doing? So let's just switch tactics and chop them, uh, get some stones. Again, you get experience for mining stones. Um, it can be quite useful to find a lighter when you're mining stones because the light, in, when it's in shadow, it's difficult to see it. So it just throws a bit of light on it and you can see what you're doing. Charging levels. There we go, but up to level. Let's go back. No, oh, I'm not standing there. So, stone pile. No, 59. Actually, that's just good enough to get a stone pile. I believe there's another deep mining, a deep vein just up there somewhere. I might gonna, you know, let's go have a look. One up here, let's go have a look. I want to know what it is. I think it's up there. It's either up there or just up here. It's somewhere around here. Uh, that stone, by the way, is silica. You do need that later on. That's buffalo. Oh, there's one of them horse things. I'm trying to ignore it for a moment. Oh, there it is. What's this one? Titan oh, that's interesting. Titanium. Ah, oh, DNA. Did I get it? Oh, sure. Oh, it's seen me. Oh, crap. How many arrows have I got? One. Okay, tech tree heads just. Get that. Get that. Get that. Ah, get that. 
set of craft. I now want bow and arrows. I can make seven. Wow, a whole seven. I'm going to run out of bone. Okay. Buffalo, I want to kill the buffalo. Yeah, so ton of titanium. That's going to be quite useful. Uh, you do need titanium later on. Um, I can do you really for trying to find an iron one. Uh, I mean, to begin with, you've got to mine the iron in the caves anyway, but um, they do become important, these things. Right, we've got to change to my bone arrows. Go. Perfect. There's a little bugger. There he is. Take all. And actually, let's make the bone knife. Wolf. There he is. He's going to go straight for me now. There we go. No, I just created the bone knife, haven't I? There it is. Place that one. So you get a bit better yield from the bone knife as well than the stone knife. Uh, I don't know if you saw there, I've got some different meat. And I've got some stringy meat, which I can now... Just head back. So, stringy meat can go on the dryer and it will turn into dried stringy meat and it gives you much better bonuses than if you just cook it. Um, bone knife, or the stone knife, I can just put it away for now. Oh, I can just throw it on the floor. Actually, you know what, I don't really need it, it's just destroyed. Yeah, it's gone. Got some bits back for doing that. Um, what do I need for? I need more bone for the spear, so I do have bone. So let's craft. Um, where is it? Bone spear. So I want to craft two of them, and I will destroy the wooden ones because I just don't need them. You can go there. You can go there. It's okay. And now I just need to craft some more bone arrows. Well, yeah, let's just repair these tools. Repair. You can't repair the torch. You've got to replace it, but I've got to spare one in my backpack. Um, just drop off some bits again. I don't need. Don't need. Don't need that. Don't need that. And um, what I can do is now look what I need to craft the fire pit. So I need a hundred stone. Alright, let's go and get some more stone. So they're very close. So there's stringy meat ready yet. Yeah, there we go. Good to see you now. And um, does that? Let's just consume some meat for now. Not got anything else to do, drop them there. Oh, we need a hundred stone. Five. So 
ahead with this. Keep going to get a bit more. Let's fill up that victory. Just a stomach recover. Now you can see as I'm mining that I've got 86, 87, 88, 88. Down the bottom there. 100, 1, 2, 3. 104.8. It's just under 105 limit. So let me craft a fire pit. I think let's craft a badly fun over there. Oh, maybe I've oxygen. Keep it topped up. Uh, fire pit. Eight. There we go. I was like to put the back here because uh, what will happen is later I replace that with a proper fire with a chimney through the roof. Although it's like to be one wall further back. But for the time being, that'll do. Um, Drop some wood in it for fuel. Just take off from here. Deactivate. Oh, I've, the charcoal is incredibly heavy by the way. So I've got 480 something. 113.7 kilos. Get rid of that. I'm down to 65. <laughs> so yeah, just be aware, charcoal is very, very heavy. I just leave it in the fire pit normally. Uh, get the meat in, turn it on, turn my line off, oops, turn my torch off. It is a bit dark in here. Hello, where do you go? Did I went too far? Ah, uh, it's like me on the sea. Oh, horsey. Alright. Be careful, I need to be able to run away very quickly. Got him. Right, this is where I need the spear and the deep water. Come on. Come to Papa. There we go. So what is it? Terranus. I should get quite a bit from this. No, oh, not that much. Oh, it's a bit disappointing. I was expecting to get more from it. Okay, so I'll just drop some wood while I'm here. You can't stack these by the way. But for me I just want to side by side. There we go. Let's just get rid of this rock. The terrorists, so they're quite vicious as terrorists. They uh um, yeah, they will attack on site maybe. The devil horses is what they are. Stamina depleted. Anything around about? So now you can hear things, but you can't see them. I'll slowly deplete this wood around here so you have better vision, uh, better long distance view. But yeah, for the time being, it's. Um, it can be a little bit troublesome seeing things that are really close. Right. Another wolf. I love voxels down here, look at those floating in the air. 
Oh, and here's a storm coming. It just rained no lightning. Yes, I did. Craft that. Okay, stick on zero. Stick on nine. Um, let's keep going for plan B. Yeah, I'm going to start taking this poison damage shortly. Oh, that's my pickaxe taken. Got the carrots. Throw one in there. Yeah, time to go with ten exposure damage. Let's put on the stone pile. So ninety kilos up to what? Hundred and twenty, so that's just like thirty kilos straight away. Okay. okay. So we're from ninety down to sixty, so that's actually sixty kilos up there. Put that up in here. Got my hammer. Um, I've got the inventory I can't read. Um, if you see there's a dark band just coming up on the um, weather indicator in the top right, uh, that's going to start damaging my building. See with the hammer in my hand, you can see the durability currently a thousand for wood. You can hear the groaning, your ability be dropping, your numbers popping up, that means it's taking damage. Um, I'll just stop it. It's not going to be long, it's not a very long storm, I'm just going to let that dark band pass, which is a point of damage as a building, and then I'll repair everything. Some of the heavier storms can uh, do quite a bit of damage. Time's getting low for anything I might be trying to uh, keep up on me. Alright, so I'm not going to take any more damage now, so now we'll start repairing it. So you use a hammer, durability goes back to 1000. That's okay, that was damaged. This what is a stone it won't take damage I guess and the floor doesn't take damage from the stone and uh no, to the pillars, but my little ramp will. Oh, no, it doesn't. Yeah, so these don't, these foundations don't. And the floor doesn't. And the door doesn't. However, it has quite a bad damage by repair, and let's just fix that. Okay. And the stone's actually brought down a tree. Uh, more than one tree by the looks of it. So. Well, well, the ski as well, we've got a chance. Oh, that thought you'd see me there, see that. Lightning will strike the trees and when you chop them down, once you've been struck by lightning, you're going to to get to the pile of charcoal. So the tree has another one knocked down to the right here, doesn't it? 
What is it? The despawn already can't be done. Oh, there it is. Well, we're getting to the level. It's good. Come here. I'm bouncing away from me. We're good, you can't dance away. And I thought there was a third one somewhere over here. There it is. Might as well take the wood while I can't turn to despawn that wood's lost. And the trees don't grow back. Currently, it's not yet anyway. What I can do if I got talents, I can just pick that. And there we go. That just increased my um, carry weight by ten, yeah, five kilos. No. One hundred, two hundred, three hundred. I can make some. Oh, plows. Once something's in your um, hot keeper at the bottom, if you if it's a um, craftable item and you place it and you have enough material in your inventory, you just need to press the number it was, so in this case 7, and it will build another one. That's fine for one-offs like this, but when you're building, like you're making your building and you need 5 or 6, you're better off just go to the crafting screen and doing it from there. Okay. And I'll put another one here just to. This won't stop everything, but it does add a little bit of defense. And what I need to do is I need to pick up my bed by pressing and holding X. And I now need to place it by my new fire. My fire pit. Go and then press and hold F to set my spawn point. Don't need in there. Oh, okay, carrots. Okay. You can go away. I need a drink. No parasite. Good. So as you can see it's now 7, 11, uh, 11 minutes past, 12 minutes past 7 if you look at the top right. It's getting dark, I don't want to be running around in the dark all night so go to bed and wake up at 7 in the morning. As if by magic. No, yeah, it's, there's nothing changes, just the time of day changes. Anything that's been cooked or anything like that it, it isn't affected. So storm, a storm won't pass during the night. You won't suddenly run out of uh, food and uh, oxygen during the night either. It's a bit dark so it's like that. Right, okay, let's use these points. What do we want next? Now, uh, level 6, so... We can get a bigger um, crate. Quite a good one. We can get some um, floor torches, which I'll definitely take. Um, are these the ones you want? Anti-poison paste? No. 
antibiotic paste. So I'll take that because I'm going to use that when I go into caves and start mining ores. And what else do I want? I want a suture case, a uh, suture kit. Because um, some of the big animals don't just give you a, a cut, they actually leave a much bigger wound in your suture kit. Okay, so floor standing torches are really good inside here just to light the place. They take wood and other things to light the room, and they use very, very little. Uh, use it very slowly, sorry. But I do need, if I go to it, you see sulfur. Where is it? There it is. We need sulfur. Currently I've got none. So I'm going to... Oop, I've got the wood up here. Let's finish chopping this wood up. <coughs> Excuse me. Got my torches burn out. Thank you for spare. I originally never used to have that uh, light so it was difficult trying to get light when you were doing things like throwing corpses on the floor and setting places alight with them and yeah, it, it was difficult. Oh god, there's no one of terror horses. Let's go that way, I'm going to go this way. Try to avoid them if I can. So I can see some sulphur here. The sulfur, sulfur along the upside, and there's some more in there. So I just mine this quickly. And I've got more talent, uh, talent points to spend, I will spend them shortly. Okay, I'll do for now. Let's head back home. And then we shall make... How many can we make? No, I don't know. I'll make a couple just for now. And I'll place one in this corner. So you don't want them right up against the corner. I mean, you can't sort of go funny. I'll try to just stand against the side of the wall. Um, it's the foot or so well. I guess there's a foot in the game world out. And I'll put one. So I've crafted two of them. I'm just going to craft one. I'll stick one. Oh, I'll just throw it on the floor. No, no, no. Um, yeah, I'll stick one in this corner for now. Then press F while they're against them. I'll just split the stack, stick 50 in there, activate it. I can deactivate that. And this one, again, stick 50 wood in there, activate it. Turn my torch off, and it's not great, but it's better than nothing. I will build another team. And I'll stick them in these other corners. Later in the game you have uh, ceiling lights and things like that. Okay. This will also helps to see a base from... Um, the reason I put that one there in those two windows. It helps you see a base when you're further away. Let's, no, no, let's just uh, allocate our talent points. So I have two points to allocate, so let's increase our mass maximum weight again. Uh, 
what else do we want? Um, more wood or more stone? Or more plant fibres? You can look at these other ones. I mean, there's the one there to increase your base health. I will do. Actually, you know what? Let's do that for now. Um, and then solo. Um, again, I can increase my health here. That's quite a big jump on that one. I'll stick my next point in there to double. Effectively, doubles your health. Okay. And there. Uh, well, let's see. I think we'll leave it for there now, guys. Um, Thanks for watching. Please comment, subscribe, all the good stuff. And uh, yeah, thanks, hey, thanks for watching. Dragonfly Gamer signing off. Bye.